Hey, what's up guys? Hope everyone out there is doing well. My name is Mike and we are about to jump right back into The Dark Pictures House of Ashes. And man, it has been a crazy ride so far. Uh, just to recap the last thing I remember playing on this, uh, we had the assault in the catacombs. That was insane. I thought I got Rachel killed, but then in the, the post little cinematic with the guy who runs that library, he was saying that somehow she's still alive. So I don't know what happened there. Um, I don't know how Kolchek killed the vampire that dragged him away from the group. Uh, I just remember seeing the scene where he was throwing it off of him and he's like, that'll teach you to mess with a Marine. I have no idea how he killed it. Um, Salim and Kolchek, they're becoming like reluctant allies and they found that elevator where that green stuff is and they're going down. I think it's a horrible idea, but where else are they gonna go, I guess? Um, Another thing, so saving Eric, uh, Colonel King, um, I remember before that assault, I was mentioning how I was like impressed with Eric because uh, Kolchik had to tell him, you know, you need to get back to the monitors. You need to do that. You're a sitting duck out here. And I was like, well, that's cool, man, because uh, Colonel King, what a good leader. He wants to lead from the front, you know? Uh, but then we got to the assault in the catacombs. He was like hiding behind the statue when everyone else was just out in the open fighting. Um, after Rachel saved him, he was just running off and they needed him. That was a pretty bastardish thing to do, man. So anyway, I'm ready to jump back in. Oh, uh, yeah. I wonder if, uh, we're going to see a vampire version of, uh, Merwin. He got killed and dragged off. Um, I don't know if we're going to see a vampire version of Clarice because we had to leave her, but, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right back in. Here we go. Hopefully we don't get anyone killed, man. Okay, we got like a prequel kind of thing, flashback. Little Hope, that's the name of one of the other anthology games, right? Heads up. Oh, no way. Oh, is this going to show the accident? Are we going to see the accident that caused him to lose his leg? I'm going to have to block this. You might have to just read the subtitles because of the song playing. Am I missing something because I haven't played the you other know, games? My sole objective, Rach, is to make you happy. Like about this guy she was talking to? I thought he was in the Air Force. Air Force doesn't I guess say that. Off my dash, you hillbilly. Whoa! I was just about to say, don't keep your feet up there. Wow! Oh, man. Oh, wow. Prove me wrong that you're not a punk ass for leaving him. Oh, they didn't even touch him. Why didn't they touch him? Okay, ooh, ooh, let's not get people killed. Uh, 
What the fuck? Oh no, she's infected, huh? Uh. She's infected, man. You. I thought I'd lost you. Oh, I think you, in the long run, did lose her. Right. Eric. Oh, shoot. I should get ready. Oh! General Baluthu or whatever. Man, he's terrifying looking. He's more terrifying than the, va the vampires. Shit, it's malfunctioning. Oh, no. Colonel, you gotta go! You too, Nick, you're coming with us! Come on, Ray! Go. How else are you gonna take this thing out? I guess you can stake him, too. Shit. He's fast. Get out of Get out of here! Find something to stake him. Terrifying. Oh no, I wasn't even ready for that. up not doing the heartbeat thing right I never get those right man no we're helping no oh god Did he go down? He went down, right? Thank me later. Let's move out. I'm never making a choice that makes them screw each other over unless I have to. Because in real life, you can't do that. You gotta work together to survive this. Is he alive still? So if the general is still alive as a vampire, is the Gutian from the beginning still alive as a vampire? And what about the rest of the army who got killed in the beginning of the game? You think that thing's gone? Looked like it went down that tunnel. Yeah, you guys aren't far. Jason's alive. Maybe things aren't going so badly after all. Back there, oh. Thanks for looking out for me. All right, let's find Kolchak. <laughs> I guess that's a response. What are you waiting for? A written invitation? Let's go. It's time. It's absolutely not the time. You can't keep playing this, man. 
Nick, listen. No, 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 you listen. Oh, man. If I get killed down here, I want to know I stood up like a real man, not some chump. Rachel, you you said you tell him when the time was right. I need you to tell him now. This is not the, the right time. You don't wear a ring because your marriage ended a year ago. He's right. It is time. Roll it out for us. Now? Right fucking now? Yes, now. We may not have another chance. <sighs> Eric, you and I, we had something very special. But that was a long time ago. I still love you, Rach. This isn't about choosing. It's about knowing what's best for me. I was on my way. I was making a new life for myself. But life has a way about it. Today, I've seen the same man I fell for all those years ago. I want to try us again. What? I... After all that shit he put you through? I she okay. That's just it. I thought I would have to. I can't turn my back on my past. I thought I was gonna have to make the choice as Rachel, but she made the choice. Wow, I did not expect that. Oh man, Nick is gonna be. Oh dude, I hope he doesn't do something that I don't control. Something crappy that I don't have control of. If I didn't give you a chance, I'd always regret it. Don't say another word. Say nothing? I understand. Colonel? Ma'am? Ugh. Let's go find Kolchak. Ultimately, this doesn't matter. She's infected. Thank you. I did not see this coming, man. I just got done talking about him in the intro for being a douchebag. He freaking left her when she needed him. She could be not infected right now if he had turned around and she chose him insane man oh this is bad this looks really bad some fucked up shit in my life nothing comes close to this they don't seem to be following do you like to wait for them or don't need to be a smart ass let's move oh finally we're doing the smart thing and letting the man with the gun lead Premonition time. Oh, frick. Okay, that is Celine getting what appears to be killed. Finds ledger from Van Heiten. All right, reading time. <clears throat> reading time, children. Uh, 29 November. Many finds in the temple confirm our hypothesis that the temple was used for sacrifice. We know that a century-long drought afflicted the Akkadian Empire, the same dry spell that affected the Old Kingdom in Egypt. Then the drought caused the abandonment of many cities across Mesopotamia and drew the Guti and Barbarian tribes down from the mountains to the plains, bringing them into conflict with the Akkadians. In this temple, we see evidence of an increasingly desperate attempt to turn the tide by appeals to the gods. Related finds, R6, Black Onyx, Mesopotamian Ur the Third period. Onyx stones were symbolic of negative energy and of calamity, perhaps due to the belief that evil Udug demons inhabited the earth. R19, Hold Stone, Mesopotamian Ur the Third period. The stone shows figures praying towards an eclipse, combined with R6, 
The piece portrays an eclipse that presages a disaster. Okay. Hey, I saw that uh, onyx stone earlier, but it wouldn't let me pick it up. R32 Ritual Tablet, Undated Acadian. This clay tablet displays a scene of religious ritual. The bull headdress worn by the priest indicates a human sacrifice of acolytes, probably to read the future in their entrails. Ah, uh, that's, they did do that crap, that's gross. This suggests that the killings went beyond just Guti and captives. R73, Battle Tablet. Clay tablet depicting a battle scene. The headpieces of the Akkadian warriors suggest this was a battle between Akkadians and Gutians. All right. I think that's it. Yep. Okay. What is this stuff, man? Why is Why is this uh green? Things came from here. Oh, that's right. They were talking about cocoons. Like from my died. Since when did you become a scientist? They don't teach you American science at school. <laughs> you should stay clear of it. Low blow. All right. I'm f thinking there was some human involvement in getting these things to uh, be birthed. Man, we are in their birthing grounds, man. They said there's like a parasitic infection. Maybe that's what this green stuff is. Belongs to Randolph Hodgson. That's the dude who had the wife. Got some intel that could help. That didn't help him. Maybe it'll help us though. Oh, well, maybe not. <laughs> Well, okay, it must have been important if it was ripped out of the book. Ooh. Who was this? No secret. So well, Jason. What? I can't end up like this. None of us want to, man. I thought Mary was still in the cell because she turned into a one of these things. How did she end up? I thought her body was in the cell. I don't know whose body was in the cell then. When this temple falls, my wife and I will be something. I owe her that, at least. The portrait that I carry in my watch case is the Mary that I remember. Not that something. Oh! Okay, so that was Randolph then. Okay. This was all Lady Bradshaw's doing. She knew all along what was down here. She led us to them. I found her below hunched over the murdered corpse of Van Hoyten. As she turned to face me, I saw that she had Ooh. changed. My hand fell to the closest weapon I could find, an iron tent peg. I stabbed her with the metal, impaling her in the heart. She died. Unholy screams echoed from deep below, as if answering the sudden release of blood. Wow. So, 
Lady Bradshaw knew of this place beforehand. Kind of like brought them down here to help her rebirth these things in so she could become a vampire. All right, I feel like we've seen all the clues that we need for the backstory. Now it's time for us to have to watch out what we're gonna do here. Time for us to be on guard. Once again, I gotta say, this game looks amazing. It's not gonna translate as good as it looks here when you see the YouTube video, but... Because there's gonna be some stuff that is lost in the encoding, but... This looks amazing, man. Yeah, what you said. What the wow. fuck is this place? There's no way this is... This looks alien. This doesn't look like it's just ancient times. Is that like an alien ship? Place men were not supposed to be. We are being judged. God is punishing us all for the mistakes we've ever made. Zane is all I have left in this world. After my wife left us, I gave him my all. I wanted him to have everything I didn't. <clears throat> Single parent. The fucking gig. It is. But my boy has made me very proud. He's going to London, to university. If only he would stop still. <laughs> I miss him so much. Is your conscience clear, Jason? Green zone. Checkpoint. What checkpoint? Build a civilian. Nick and I... We were caught in traffic. Checkpoint had been hit before by suicide bombers. Woman. She was carrying a bag. Fuck. Tell me. I ordered. I ordered for her to stop, loud and clear, but she didn't. She just kept on walking. I uh. I had to make a call. Nick. He shot her dead. What was in the bag? Groceries. I don't understand. Why didn't she stop? She didn't hear me. Maybe she Get didn't... Fucking headphones on. Ah. Uh. You shouldn't walk up to a this, checkpoint with head, uh, headphones on. This bullshit. I'm not here to honor the dead. Truth is, my life was going nowhere fast. I jumped at the chance to sign up. We all have our reasons. They don't have to be profound. Just want to say, this is cool, man. Them opening it up to each other, that's good. He's softening up a bit. Found, huh? No towers were hit. I was stoned out of my fucking skull. I didn't even hear about it till a week later. How's that for profound? 
I don't wow. even know what the fuck I'm doing here. That means I joined the military before he did. You're serving your country. That woman had a family, friends. She had her whole life in front of her. And we snuffed it out with a single bullet. I mean, what the fuck? Okay, this is good. You gotta stay I on guard, though. Thinking. We're waiting for something to happen. Maybe we should take the initiative and make something happen. Uh oh. Would you have mine? Make noise? We go inside there and we find a way to hurt them. Those fucking things tried to fuck with our heads. They tried to kill us. But you and I, we're both standing. Start believing, Salim. We're gonna get out of here and see the sun again. Is that what you truly believe? Hoorah! What on earth is that sound? It's a marine thing. Oh. So, does that make me a marine too? Let's not get ahead of ourselves, huh? Okay. Hey, whatever happens out there, I've got your back. We'll stand together. Good. It's the only way. Proud of you guys. Especially you, Kolchek. You were kind of a douche in the last part. Man, we've been circling around them for a good portion of the last one and this one. What is this, man? Is this like alien stuff or what? Like, is that the parasite with these spore looking things? Uh oh. Don't breathe in. Don't breathe that stuff in, man. It could be bad. Oh no, is that one of them? Just a statue? Yeah, these things do kind of look alien, don't they? They don't... I mean, yeah, they kind of resemble Pazuzu, but... They look kind of alien. Dang, this game looks spectacular. Stay close. Explore the unknown. Find a way to strike back. Search the area. This gotta be where those things come from. I think so. While this all has looked pretty spectacular, I might edit out part of this just to fit time. All I did was walk around in awe. Stay close. I ain't going nowhere. Sleep over here. What do you make of it? This place could have been down here for thousands of years. God didn't make these creatures. No. It's possible we've got this wrong way around. What's that supposed to mean? Maybe we're intruding on them. Oh, yeah. Maybe these were here before men. How far down do you think we are? Difficult to say. It's easy to lose track of time down here. But maybe these things are aliens that crash landed on the planet a long time ago. Instrument? So. Sounds like music. That don't sound like any music from where I'm from. Okay, maybe not music. Could be, uh... 
Communication. You've seen those motherfuckers. They're not exactly the chatty type. We shouldn't underestimate them. Look at this place. Those things are intelligent. Mm. Oh boy. What are we messing with, man? So crazy, these things. These like consoles where the dead vampires are sitting in them. Like they control stuff. It's everywhere. Is it just me or is it alive? Oh, we're gonna get to inspect one now. Man, these things are crazy. Yeah, it looks like a console where they kind of, uh, I don't know, monitor their environment or something? Control things? They can't be pilot chairs. Sleep. Check this out. It's one of those creatures, only older, ancient. You don't think it's alive, do you? Touch it. No. That's, you touch it. That's stupid. Pussy. Don't do it. Can I make the choice not to? It looks like I have to. Damn it. Oh no. Stupid. Did you see that? Of course I fucking saw it. That creature is fossilized. It's oh. millions of years old. Wow, that was dumb. So why did they leave the bodies of their dead ancestors just sitting in those? Man, this is so weird. Hey, someone else made it this far. No way! Th that's the Gutian, man. Wow. Goddamn biblical. That's the Gutian. Don't tell me he's still alive. Holy crap! Ah! Shit! Oh shoot! Did you see that? That scared me, man. I think he's still alive. Oh, that's impossible. In this place, everything's possible. Holy oh, shit! Fucker's been alive all this time. Just sitting here with half a head. Wow! Must have preserved his flesh, his brain. What should we do? We can't leave him like this. Well, shit. She had enough time to get used to it. I'm serious. Oh. The noise will attract the vampires. <sighs> I'll do it. Wow. The Gutian was alive this whole time. Why was he not turned into a vampire? I got so many questions about that. Man. So this same stuff is the reason why General Belutha, what his name, whatever his name is, why he's still alive. But he's more of a vampire. The Gutian didn't look like a vampire at all.
Oh, this is crazy. Yeah, and I mean, while this all looks great too, I might edit parts of this out if I'm just walking around. Man, this place is so massive. I am so- oh shoot, bats? I'm so surprised this is in a- in this game. There's such a massive scale to this game, man. I never thought we would be this massive if we were underground. Look at those things, man. They're crazy. Oh, that's the skull of one of them. It's lame. Looks like someone's been avoiding the dentist. No fangs. Can you see? The bone is ruptured where they should be, as though smashed from the inside out. What are you saying? Maybe these things weren't originally vampires. Maybe they got infected. Ah. Wow. They're saying that these all could have been humans? Uh, why can't I move? Why can't I move? What the? Ah, oh, did it bug on me? It bugged on me. I'm gonna have to restart this. Can't believe it, man. That's the first time the game's bugged on me. There we go. Thankfully, all I had to do was just go out and come back in. I didn't have to restart. Yeah, sorry guys. I'm gonna have to edit some of this out. This place is just too massive and... I wanna keep it more concise. Oh man, bunch of these things. So the cocoons turn into these creatures. It's late. It's like the wings are part of the cocoon. I think we hit the mother load. Man, whoa, what is... Wow, those are all cocoons. Oh man. Quietly. Oh shoot. We're gonna have to watch our step in here, man. I hope these things don't wake up, man. Man, it's like I can hear them moving in their cocoons. Shoot. I don't know. I'm trying to see which way I can go here. Oh man, this is a freaking maze. Look at these things, man. This is the cocoon. It's like the wings are part of the cocoon and those just stay in the final form of the creature. I made it. Okay. 
like two of those creatures are here. Check this out. They died fighting each other. Like dogs fighting over food. Don't make sense. I thought these things were a pack. Trained, disciplined. Why would they fight each other? Every living thing on Earth finds a reason to fight its own. Not sure these things are from Earth. Well, you said it earlier when you were looking at that skull that these things even might have been infected by something else. The same thing that causes vampirism in the the humans. So maybe this vampirism was from a different planet too, this infection. Oh no! I didn't even do anything! How did it wake up? Oh shoot! Ah! Oh man! This is not good! Oh, they're here! They're here! Oh, yes! Oh, wow, they got here fast, man. I'll cover you! Go! This is definitely some alien stuff, man. Shit, Nikki. You turned up like the fucking cavalry. I thought you were dead. Not my time. But where's the rest of them? Where's Eric and Rachel? Oh. Girl, you made it. Man, crawling through that tunnel was a highly unpleasant experience. Oh man, is she getting worse now? Good to see you again, ma'am. She's getting worse. Take my hand. I'm glad you're here, man. This place. The archaeologist team has made it here. There's a desk. Star chamber. Oh, that was in the uh, journals and stuff. This is where Marie was spending most of her time researching this spot. What is this place? Star Chamber. Okay. So, Marie got infected down here, though. We need a plan. Fuck those things up and get the fuck out. Good plan. <laughs> Sergeant K, what do we got left? So we got um, eight clips of 556 FMJ, three 40 mil high X rounds, a couple of nine mil pistols, four clips between them. We'll make that work. Huh. Phosphorus. Plus two phosphor rounds. And one block of composition C4. Well, what about the UV lamp? Took a knock, but I can fix it. Just need a minute. All in is not enough. We've also got this. Oh yeah, that old dynamite. It's old, unpredictable. Shouldn't even be handling it. Now fuses are shot, but we can use the C4 to detonate them. Let's just hope they still back a punch. The vampires come from those cocoons. You saw how many there were in that vault? There could be thousands in there. Should we blow them up? Burn as many of those motherfuckers as we can and head for the surface. What do you think, Sergeant? Ooh, rah. 
I'm not gonna allow him to carry a pistol. We are way past that point now, ma'am. We stand together as one. Yeah. Why is it focusing on the wounds? Still got that med kit. Now would be a good time to use it. It's looking pretty late. I can only patch up one person. Oh, that was the one from Joey. The press back home would have a field day with this. Oh, nice. He healed him. He was pretty hurt. Looks like our explorer friends were here, too. We should search this place before we move out. There. Got it. Cool. Okay, now we get to do some more exploring, some read some journals and stuff, search the chamber, talk with allies. Music. <laughs> Almost like Ode to Joyish. I don't even know how to read those, I'm just kind of guessing. It's been a long time since I read music. As I discover more about the- well- as I discover more about the musical language of these creatures, my mind spins in wonder at how they came to be here. Did they soar through the skies in the days of dinosaurs? Did their great empire span the globe while we were still swinging from the trees? They are dead now. Their forms are somewhat like our own, but everything else about them is alien to life as we know it. The console displays what appears to be a constellation of stars, Cetus, as seen from Earth. Did they come here from beyond, crossing great gulfs of space to land here? Were they trying to get home? All right, that confirms it for sure now. Definitely aliens. Um, I don't know. So they have some kind of weird musical communication. We found that instrument earlier. Uh, premonition time. What? Who the hell was that? I didn't know who Over here. either of those people were. I found something. That was weird. Okay, this is uh, probably going to be an unpleasant conversation between the two of them. How confident are you that they'll work? They'll work. This thing with you, me, and... Uh... Forget it, Nick. I'm just saying... Don't. Keep your head clear of everything but the task ahead. It's the only way we'll live. Thank you. Yes, you should never have been talking about any of this crap down here. Life and death situation. Here, let me help you. It's fine. I've done it before. I've done it many times since. Sorry. Rachel, wait. I'm sorry. You always were better at changing this thing than I was. If you need me, I'm here for you. Okay, odd response, seeing how they decided to give each other a chance again. Okay, FAO, Pullman, new equipment requests, 12 pickaxes, Thousand foot of rope, twenty nine plywood box, eternal twelve hundred liters. I don't know what eternal is. Seven hundred ninety watts by five ten hertz. Arc lamps, twenty of them, plus a generator. Crowbars, four six gas masks. EVH. To so whoever finds what this. Was in it for him? Oh. Is it really all about these tablets? To whoever finds this, forgive me. I have sabotaged the dynamite to prevent my colleagues from sealing this temple to the world. Lady Bradshaw was right to bring me here. These creatures are a key to limitless power. Uh, there are secrets here that could allow humanity to reach across the stars. Perhaps even achieve immortality itself. Please safeguard this ruin and do not think badly of me for what I have done. I serve only the future. Ellis Van Hoyten? Oh man. So she got him on board with her plans. Man, I just I can't get over how massive this uh, portion of the game is. What I wouldn't give 
to see daylight again. <laughs> daylight and a cold one. That whole mess with you and Nick. It's out in the open, right? It's for the best. But regardless of everything else, secrets keep you sick. Yep. I think he just realized that when him and Salim were talking and he got it off his chest about the uh, civilian. They are coming. We must end it here with something. If there is time, my last act will be to dictate this diary onto something found in the rubble. It can serve as a warning to any who's something. The bones of this temple are drenched in blood. We have set foot on an uncharted shore and roused something ancient and wicked. A blasphemy that comes in indescribable shapes and forms. For eons we lived as children in this world, unaware of the horrors that slumber beneath our feet. Now we have blindly thrown open the gates to madness. I fear being taken, but I must do what I must. We must seal this place for eternity. For all mankind. Mary, I'm sorry. Wow. So he was the one manning the gun? Wait, you better not freaking crash on me. Why is this taking so long? What the hell? Ugh, okay, good. I thought I was about to crash again. This is gonna be the third- that would have been the third time. That I've had an issue. This playthrough. Um, None of them made it out alive. It's kind of weird because I haven't had any issues before this time I sat down to play today. Okay, well that was crazy by the way. Um, I feel like that was the last journal. Which means we must be close to the end of the game because I got an achievement for that. Okay. We have a cycle thingy here. Um, hunts a victim, then it implants a parasite, the parasite gestates, the host dies, parasite takes over, and continue the cycle. Wow. Yeah, again, so I don't understand, like, do the ali did the aliens contract a vampirism thing from somewhere, or is this just the nature of these creatures? formed from chords, musical scales, sonics. Mary was a pianist. She deciphered it. She thought these carvings represented the stars. Do you see? Lucky see she was a pianist. The whale. We're a long way from the night sky. It's a mystery. According to the journal, there was only one scale of sound in the device. But Mary was studying it alone. I think there may be another. I'm going to need your help. What can I do? This console is too big to operate single-handedly. Okay. Oh. All right. Do I just push when he pushes? Oh, maybe I hold it down? Oh, move it? Okay. Here we go. I don't even know if what I'm doing is right. Nice. 
nice. I don't know what I did, but I did it. Wait, I hope that's not a bad thing. I hope this doesn't wake up the sleeping ones or something. Isn't that something? And Mary believed that these creatures were once peaceful. Their language was one of music. How could they not feel emotion? Then a tragedy fell upon them. Their great empire collapsed. Their music fell silent. Oh no. They turned on each other. The parasite is reacting to it? What happened? Sickness? And madness? What turned them from architects into killers? Whatever it is, it twisted them. Now they're creatures of hate. Animals. Dead things. Phosphorus? No one left to kill. What is she doing? So they slept. What is she? And they waited. Wait, does the parasite like take control of you and you can't control yourself? They waited for us. What is going on? Rachel! What the hell? Is she not in control of herself? Rachel? Rachel! Rachel! Oh, what is she doing? She's not trying to take herself out, is she? Rachel! Rachel. Rachel, look at me. She has it. It's inside her. Oh. Oh wow, that was a cool lighting change. It went to like an overhead light. She's experiencing something. Oh, the ship! Oh yeah, it looks like the whale too, like the, the console. Ah, so they did crash land on Earth. Can we stop her? I'm sorry. Or I am Rachel. I can stop myself, I hope. Yes. No way, man. No, I'm not doing it. Clarice lasted a long time and she doesn't even look like as bad as Clarice did. They came from the stars. This isn't their home. It's an arc. Do something! She's turning into one of them! Please, Rachel, you have to hold on! It's killing me! Yeah, but you don't even look as bad as Clarice did. You got- I'll put her out of her misery. Hold her the fuck down. No. We can still save her! There's gotta be a way we can't lose her! There's no other way. Hold her down. No, man. You gave up on her like you gave up on Clarice? Uh, kill me, I'm turn. Don't do it. No, don't do it, man. Jason. Don't do it. I have to put you down. No. Tense, what are you waiting for? It's me, dude. It's me, Jason. Please, put down the gun. Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh. oh, man. Why didn't you do it? You gotta have hope. Wait, wait, may I suggest something? Fuck, man, just say it. There may be another way. The fluid in the cocoons. Shit, I think I know where you're going with this. What's she talking about? The fluid. It keeps the flesh alive, but it stops the aging. How could you possibly know that? I saw it. Oh. A man covered in this fluid. He should have been dead, but he was alive. It kept him alive. If we can get Rachel in there, it could stop The Gutian. Are you for real? It was the Gutian that he's talking That's about. That's crazy. We don't know anything about it. 
It could stop her from transforming. The cocoon will keep her safe until we return with help. It's our only hope. Not being cocooned, just, yeah, I mean, that's the only other thing we can do. Just do it. Anything to stop this. Okay, guys, this has been a pretty buggy and problem problematic uh, playthrough for me tonight. I don't know why, but uh, the game crashed, OBS crashed. Um, I don't know if there's something going on with my uh, graphics card maybe being overloaded or something uh, by running the game and running OBS on the same computer. I don't. I have no idea. I'm like semi tech savvy, but not fully. I'm stopping this. Uh, before I had to go back and I had to replay part of this because I actually made it further than this and um, if you haven't played this game before I won't say what's about to happen I'll just say that uh, the next minute or two I've already seen in fact there's something happened that I got an achievement for but god just super annoying I don't know why I've had so many issues tonight anyway yeah just a disclaimer I have seen what's about to happen the next one to two minutes uh, here we go No more time. Maybe we can burn the infection out of her. I'll do it. She's dying. <laughs> what? <sighs> Just as gross as the first time. So here's my question, um, is that like basically how all the aliens reproduce or is this like specifically a vampirism infection that can infect either the aliens or humans? Okay, not in there. You in here? I gotta hear something. Where are you, little bastard? It goes pretty deep. Gross, man. Look at this thing, man. It's freaking disgusting. The detail is so good. That's what makes it so gross. It looks like a mutated shrimp. So are these the kids of the aliens? Like this is what their baby forms look like? They're, they start out as a parasite? Or is this thing causing vampirism and can infect both the aliens and humans? This is as far as I saw earlier before OBS and the game crashed. Got some uh, error code from NVIDIA pop up too. Okay. Um, I probably would have gone further tonight, but I had so many issues that I just, it's, had to burn the midnight oil, um, and I, yeah, I'm done, man. Um, I feel like this is a good stopping point anyway, though, uh, cause it looks like, yeah, next objective is to destroy the cocoon vault. Uh, that might be the last portion of this, uh, playthrough, but, um, yeah, what a, a excellent game, man. Took a major turn in this play, this part of the playthrough that I never would have expected. This whole time I was thinking this was, a uh, uh, I guess you could say it was, they did say it was an ancient evil, but I didn't think it was aliens. I thought it was just demons, man. Um, but then again, I don't quite understand all of this. I don't understand 
I've probably said it already like six or seven times during this playthrough, but I don't understand if um, this parasite is what causes the vampirism and if this parasite infected both the aliens and humans. Uh, because earlier we found the skulls of uh, two aliens fighting each other. Maybe they were fighting each other because some of them had the parasite. Or is this just the way the aliens reproduce and they can only reproduce by parasitically by infecting other creatures, which I, that kind of doesn't make sense to me because they were talking about how the aliens used to be peaceful. So I just, I don't know, my logic in my head, I feel like at one point they got, they ran across this parasite of vampirism and that's why they had to flee their, their home. Maybe there was too many of them and the parasite actually followed him on the ark because some people had it. Uh, some aliens had it. I don't know, man. I, if anyone can explain it to me, that would be awesome. But, um, yeah, super psyched that, um, you know, I thought Rachel was done for sure. I thought um, once she was infected, that was it. I didn't know there was an actual big-ass shrimp parasite inside of you. I thought the parasite really meant like uh, just like a virus thing in your blood. But um, yeah, I did not expect her to turn around and be just all of a sudden cured once she spit it out. Thought she was done for for sure. So um, yeah, eager to see what happens in the next one. If you made it this far into the video, just want to say thanks for hanging out with me um, and enjoying this movie with me. This has been great. Um, we'll see you guys in the next one.